हाय एवरीवन वेलकम बैक टू आवर चैनल देसी डू एक्सप्लोरर्स टुडे वी आर इन पुजनान एंड वी हैव प्लान टू एक्सप्लोर इट ऑन वीकेंड सो लेट्स स्टार्ट We started our day with a morning train from Warsaw to Poznan which took approximately 3 hours. After reaching Poznan, first we made our way to check into our hotel. We had booked the Ibis Hotel which was located on the walking distance from the Poznan Central Station. And here we have reached our hotel and now it's time to take a tour of our stay. After relaxing for some time we first decided to go for lunch as it was already noon and we were feeling hungry We went to Taj India and Indian restaurant to grab our lunch All over it was a nice restaurant for having good food with a beautiful interior and a nice lake view After our lunch we started walking towards Park railway station which was located nearby to enjoy the Maltanka train journey of Poznan The standard single ticket costs around 15 PLN Now we are here and we will be taking the train. This is the train station and from here you can buy the ticket and here is one shop is there from where you can purchase water or ice cream anything you want. And here our train has arrived. So we will be departing on this train in some time and then we will go to our next destination. This train route is very beautiful which runs along way from the lake and through a little jungle. This is a great attraction especially for children. The Minisha railway is seasonal so check before going for this
After this beautiful ride of train, we get down at the Maltanka station. Next, we had planned to visit Poznan Cathedral, so we started walking towards it. Although the cathedral is quite a distance out of the city, 20 minute walk or so is definitely worth the visit. It's the first cathedral to have been built in Poland and the beautiful Gothic facade contrasts with the more austere interior. The Arch Cathedral Basilica of St. Peter and St. Paul in Poznan is one of the oldest churches in Poland and the oldest Polish cathedral dating from the 10th century. It is an amazing cathedral that was restored after World War II. Entry to this cathedral was free. One can get an amazing impression when you look at this unique monument both inside and outside. It's a peaceful, artistic and religiously rich place definitely worth visiting. After visiting the cathedral, we made our way towards the city center. After walking for a few minutes, we came across a beautiful square filled with fountain and people. There were many spots to sit, relax and enjoy the evening. In this area, you will also find few restaurants and cafes. We visited a beautiful Tokyo Cheesecake Bakery. It's a lovely place with extremely delicious cheesecake and beautiful interior. It is a top spot in Poznan for Japanese cheesecake. After enjoying our dessert, we started walking towards the old market square of Poznan. If you enjoy pavement culture, then this square is perfect. This square is a beautiful part of Poznan which offers so much to see and do.
architecture design of the town hall really make the square stand out which is the highlight of this square. This square reminds you of Gidans and Roslaw Old Town. All the way around it are umbrella covered restaurants and bars letting you watch the world go by. The architecture is beautiful with lots of side streets leading to some cracking bars and restaurants. It's a great place to enjoy the evening. Next we took tram and went to visit Imperial Castle. But unfortunately when we went there it was under renovation and we were not able to go inside. But the whole square looks beautiful in the evening lights. Here we also came across monument of the victims of June 1956 focusing on the key dates from the strikes and demonstrations in Poznan. We went to visit the castle garden as it was open to sit, relax and enjoy the evening. When it was dark we again came back to the city center. went to a Mexican restaurant to have our dinner. The restaurant has a great look and feel, atmosphere is amazing and the food is good as well. With this beautiful evening, we ended our day one in Poznan and see you in our next video where we will continue our exploration of Poznan. Thanks for watching. And don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and hit the notification bell for more travel adventures.